So this is a video about calling out, calling upon the name of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai. Man, it's a beautiful, uh, honorary thing for uh, calling upon His name and just being in the truth, pure. You know, um, this my this my testimony. You know, I'm just a part of that. Hopefully, uh, like you know, the one that no prophet, no teacher. I'm just in my lot, just. Man, uh, waking up to the truth years ago, and uh, it's just my little testimony video uh, about calling upon the name of Yahweh Hashem. I have several accounts I have seen. Um, just apologize about that. And um, so the first about calling upon the name, I remember I was just. Uh, I was we I was just with my two third partner, you know. And uh, I'm I'm brand new for the truth, and uh, I remember on the way coming back from Reno, I look up to the sky, and all I see was two chariots in the form and the clouds. Though I didn't even, like freak out and then I was like, okay, that's the chariots. Oh shit, you know I don't want to say that. All oh, these niggas, these niggas look at me like you crazy or something, you know. So I came up to myself, I seen it. I'm like, man, this shit is real, straight up. You know, the, the spirit bearing us, which all spirit, you know, that, you know, that we are the children of the most high, you know. And I never count on me I was just, uh, went to Walgreens and I'm picking up, picking up my mother's medicine. And, um, I don't know if I had it. I don't think I had enough. Yeah, I don't think I had enough. And, like, out of nowhere, like, five hours came out of nowhere, like, wasn't nobody walking behind me, in front of me, on the side of me. The five dollars just came out of nowhere. So I'm like, you know what? All prices are going to your house. I see you on the shot. You know, I didn't know I was going to get my mother's medicine. But this one, this, this real one situation where the Lord delivered me out of this situation. And I encourage your brothers, like, you know, you dealing with a woman who got kids. I know that shit can be stressful. And, you know, say you don't have with them kids, you know. At the time, I was dealing with my little chick, you know, my girl, whatever, woody woo woo, and um, an accident happened where I kind of was, you know, probably, you know, probably should have left him alone, you know, you, you know, same was on. I kind of like walked him up a little bit. Shouldn't, shouldn't have did that shit at all, you know. I still, you know, feel kind of bad about that shit today, and um, and uh, shit, you know, cause it, the shit real, the shit, you know, it really got funky, you know. Uh, I, I was uh, doing childcare, you know, and, and going to work at the same time. Uh, I remember I was just doing childcare, but anyway, I was watching her kids, and then I got a little bit too aggressive, and uh, you know, trying to uh, chastise them a little bit. And just, you know, I can't believe that shit. But anyway, can't believe I did that shit. But anyway, and uh, so you know, I asked, uh, you know, he had to go to the hospital and shit. I uh, guess he said he had a concussion. And, it's just so on spooks. So I'm like, I know that I know if the bitch called her uh, she called CPS, all kind of shit. She goes her child, you know, I could go to jail, you know, for child and uh child child endangerment, you know, so all kind of shit. You know, the shit really got funky, you know. The bitch could have pressed charges the whole shit, but all I kept doing all I kept doing was calling upon the name of the Lord, like Lord, you how about she on shot, you how about she on shot, you how about she on shot. You know, not 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 to let not to let nothing happen to you, not not even to let me get locked up. You know, I, I was spooked for my life. I'm like, cause I know I made a mistake. Like, man, I can, you know, Satan how about them again? Kids to fuck with me. I already, you know, already got a temper, so I'm like, fuck. And um, I mean, I I, I just kept a calling upon the name, right? I got delivered out that situation. You feel me? And uh, man, it is beautiful, man. The, the, the shit that you go through that you call upon the name and you be delivered from your situation, uh, your house or whatever whatever you going through in life. Like you call upon the name and man, you good. Like everyday life from you know, I was watching a brother, uh, you know, from the LA camp and one of the other IKM that uh, you know, they was just doing their testimony they testimonies about calling upon the name and I mean, it's real, straight up, <laughs> it's real. How about she on shot? You know, I'm so thankful for uh, being in the truth and 
knowing the name and calling it upon the name of the Lord, I strong to her straight up. So, man, because we coming into these last days, you know, shit, every day I'm calling upon the name no matter what. I don't give a damn. But this is just, just, just my testimony, you know. Shout out to my brother.